This is a group of crows. Most people think about a group of crow and they say murder of crows, but I'll give you some alternate titles. Horde, muster, congress. Um, in the winter, crows do what we call a crow roost, big communal winter crow roost. Right now I'm at a spot that's a staging site where they gather before they hit the roost. So right now around me there's probably five, there's probably about a thousand, two thousand crows I can see right here. They just get really quiet. <laughs> um, but crows are fascinating, and this winter crow roost in Lawrence, Massachusetts is really well known. Go to wintercrowroost.com to learn more. But this crow roost has somewhere about ten to 15,000 birds in January and February. And they come from anywhere, from like very local birds, to anywhere up to 500 miles away to gather in the evenings down along the river here. Um, here comes a bunch more streaming in. Let's see if we get them on camera. Oh, oh, and a bunch more behind me, and a bunch more. We got crows everywhere, folks. As crows gather, think about like story of the day. Crows are probably exchanging a ton of information about their day, where they were, what they ate, what they saw, who knows, what they felt, I don't know. Crows have a very complex social communication, uh, vocal communication skills, and we're not sure about a lot of what they're talking about, but they are super social, um, and this is really common every single night here. So, I'll just let you listen for a minute. And in a few minutes, they're gonna go all down together, probably 10 to 15,000 birds down along the river in a big cluster of trees down there. Hopefully I'll get some footage there too, but otherwise, American crow, Corvus bracarhynchus, fascinating bird, good bird.